What's going on smart people? Today is formally the start of the weekly vlog. Today's actually Tuesday. I was going to start it on Monday, but it was too hectic of a day to actually be able to film anything. It was just me going back and forth between a bunch of different places. Today's a little bit more lax. I only have one class, which is statistical mechanics. I can't find my statistical mechanics notebook, so I have to do that before class. It's about 7.30 in the morning right now. Class is at nine. Let's get to it. I really do need to find this notebook though. <laughs> Found it. Nice, let's get out of here. This is the TA office. This is where all the cool kids hang out. This is my little cubicle. This is Abhishek. He's my rival. He's kind of a bit of a wild card. Uh, you never know if he's gonna ask a really good question, give a good answer, or just take a shirt off. This is Sharad. Your, your mystery. <laughs> So we just all got out of statistical mechanics. I think it's a lot easier to sit through that than two and a half hours of quantum. I didn't record yesterday because it was two hours of quantum and then straight to field theory and then straight to TA meetings and then straight to tutoring and then SI. It was just back and forth. It would have been boring. But now we just all got out of our... Is that all of your only classes today? Uh, we have another class at two. What classes do you guys have? Computational? Oh, we we computational. have more modern material. So you're taking that, you're taking computational, but that's yes. on Mondays and Wednesdays? No, it's on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Tuesdays and Thursdays, okay. But I'm done for today. Krishna's done for the day. Yeah, I'm pretty much done for the day, except for still have quantum homework, and then we got stat mech due on Thursday. Quantum is actually coming along pretty nicely. It's about 12 pages so far. Very nice. Special guest in here now. You guys might recognize this guy. It is, can you focus please? Uh, this is Andrew from the 200th Daily Upload. He gave us a tour of NMSU back when I was still a Pinocchio grad student, before I was a real boy. Before I'm a real boy. Yeah. Andrew is not in this office. This is, um, I don't know how they decide what office you get stuck in, but he's upstairs. Yeah, basically if you're, well, I would say that if you're doing research, you don't, you're generally not in this office, but Sharad kind of breaks the rule on that. And Nirajan. And Nirajan, yes. And Krishna, right? Uh, but, yeah. Are you doing research? Yeah. No. So yeah, I don't know how the room distribution works anymore. The cool thing about Tuesdays, it is, what, 11.30 something, and I get to go home now. So I'm about to go, I think Andrew's about to head out. Goodbye everybody. I'll see you tomorrow with the camera again. This is gonna take getting used to. Now I am back in a more familiar setting. Just because I'm home early does not mean that there's not plenty to do. I still have a little bit left to finish for my quantum mechanics homework that is due tomorrow, but it's part of a part of a problem, so that'll take no time at all. Famous last words. I also have to record and edit and upload today's video, which is not this video. It is one of the heavy math and physics videos that I will be doing every Tuesday, and in this case, it's on the metric tensor that I'm excited about. So then after that, then I can finally get started on my statistical mechanics homework homework that is due later in the week. Now, since my whiteboard is all clean, I can work on putting this into today's video. And just like that, that is one more thing checked off the list for today. Got the tensor calculus video done. It is just rendering in YouTube right now. Now I can finally get started on statistical mechanics. It's due on Thursday. So it's only six o'clock now, so I can go at this for a few more hours and then I have all day to work on it tomorrow. <laughs> Almost forgot to mention the really good news for today. My dry erase board wipes came in. I've been using the spray bottle and the paper towels like a Fucking pilgrim. So I'm glad I'm in the 21st century now. I'm gonna call this video for today. I'll see you guys tomorrow, but that'll just be the next clip for you. Cool. Day two. Today should be a moderately busy day, and the reason for this is that there's more going on throughout the day, and I still have a lot to get done after school. So yesterday I only get out, or I get out at like 11 a.m., so that's pretty early, and then I got to spend all day doing homework. Today I won't get out until around 3 p.m., which is still not bad, except for I also still have to finish all my statistical mechanics homework, so that should be interesting. So I'm gonna bring the camera to school, probably introduce you to some more people in the graduate department, and uh, so today I have quantum mechanics and quantum field theory and quantum mechanics is from 9 to 10 15 and then I have a nice little gap to get some work done and then from 12 to 1 15 I have quantum field theory and then finally from 2 to 3 I have to tutor also after reading the comments I'm seeing that people enjoyed the tensor calculus video so that's a good way to start the day so let's get started if you were wondering where Kelly's been through all this she's at this astronomy thing 
learning how to observe out of a certain type of telescope. So she won't be back until Thursday. So I had to, I, di I didn't even have her as an alarm clock today. Bottom is all printed out, all 12 pages. You ready, Abhishek? Psst. Psst. <laughs> this is Nirajan. He comments on videos. He is our grader for statistical mechanics, and he's very lenient at that. I'm a very harsh grader. He's really not. <laughs> we just got out of quantum mechanics. We turned in our homework. So far, we don't have homework for the next week. So statistical mechanics is due tomorrow, and if he doesn't assign another homework, we have a chance of not having any homework assigned for this next week. That would be pretty nice, because we don't have homework for quantum yet. I have quantum field theory in an hour or so. Maybe he won't assign homework. Maybe it's just wishful thinking. I don't know. Nirajan, do you know if we're getting homework for classical mechanics? Or not classical mechanics, statistical mechanics this week? We turn in our stat mech tomorrow. Do you know if he's going to give us more homework tomorrow? Since you're the um, working on, on the inside. I don't think so. I hope not. Because we didn't get homework for quantum. I didn't get homework when I just went to QFT. Mm -hmm. So I might have no homework. Because you didn't have homework? Yeah. <laughs> Come on. I don't want homework. Because quantum, what? Are we going to get homework on Bessel functions? QFT, yeah, actually that would be pretty helpful to have homework on that right now. Because <laughs> I'm about to have to go tutor. And then that'll be a wrap for today. Then I can finally get finished ish on StatMech, hopefully. Oh, you started? No, I've barely started. Oh, the graduate is not lazy. Not lazy. We had quantum due today. I think it's understandable. Just finished tutoring for the day. Now everything on campus is taken care of, so I can go home and finish up all the statistical mechanics. It's a bit harder than I thought it would be, but I have all night to finish it. I should be good to go. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting, and they had to hire a new one. Oh my god, it's fine. Okay, I'm done with the statistical mechanics homework. To be honest with you, it wasn't that hard. I'm just not particularly great at statistical mechanics, so I had to spend a lot of time. To be honest, I think I'm not too great at statistical mechanics because I haven't found like a really good book that I like. In this Pathria book, it's okay. Going through it and beating my head against the wall was an effective method to figuring out how to solve these problems. But I feel like they're like quantum mechanics books. There's so many good resources if you don't understand something with quantum. But for StatMech, I just haven't found that yet. So it's it's just it's more of a learning curve for me to figure this stuff out. But StatMech homework is done, uh, and now I'm getting emails from students that I TA for saying that they are getting zeros assigned to their grades for no reason. I haven't graded anything since last week, so gotta get that figured out. So I, I, one thing conquered, one more thing pops up to conquer, so hopefully I can figure out how to not accidentally fail these kids. Okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thursday, Valentine's Day, got stat mech due, it's all done, but some people are still still working on it. Oh, happy, happy stat mech. Happy stat happy mech. mech. Rigo's wearing red every day this week because Valentine's Day is his favorite holiday. Happy Valentine's Day. I have no Valentine. <laughs> we just got out of statistical mechanics and had to submit all of our homeworks. I'm so glad that's over with. I, but I still have, now until for like the rest of the day, I just have to grade. <laughs> I'm gonna spend the entire weekend grading papers. While these guys are finishing up the homework, I'm gonna get to grading. <laughs> <laughs> what I just realized is, so for quantum, we weren't given homework after we turned in our homework. For quantum field theory, I didn't get homework over the weekend. And now, after stat mech, we don't have homework. So we are free for the weekend. What was that? You're free. I'm free. <laughs> it does feel cool that I don't officially have any homework for my courses to get done over the weekend. That's a nice little load off. However, I am meeting with one of my professors to talk Quantum Field Theory 1 material. And I don't know if I mentioned this in a previous clip or not. I forgot how forgetful I am. But he basically said, uh, if I if I keep up with quantum field theory one and second quantization, he'll want to do like a research project with me. So this next week, we're going to be meeting to talk about some of the homeworks that he gave me. So I do still have that to get done. But
but you know having no other official homework to get done is nice so now I just finished recording my video for the day it is actually a physics meme review so I hope people enjoy that people tend to and I put out a poll on what my next heavier math video should be math physics video should it be like another tensor one or something new and it's seeming like people are starting to really enjoy the tensor video so I'm glad that that's actually catching some traction which is nice Last day of the week. Today is Friday. Kelly and I are about to go to school for a little bit. I have to TA from 10.30 until 1 and she has um, meetings and work to get done there. So let's just, let's just jump right into it. Let's freaking do this. Hi. <laughs> like I said, the only thing that I have going on today is I have to TA lab and on top of that, I guess it's still lab related, is I have to grade all of these papers. So that's gonna be pretty fun. I'm gonna take a look over the lab that they're actually doing today. Uh, lab starts in 20 minutes, so I got some time to make sure that I can answer all the questions. Normally I kind of go through the lab once myself just to make sure that if they show me a section, I'm not just seeing it for the first time because that wouldn't be fair to them. Today they're like taking motion blur pictures of something. They have like a high exposure camera that uh, in a dark room you take a picture of something moving and blinking and then since it's high exposure you'll see like lines and motion blur that'll be telling you how fast or how much distance an object is covering over the frame rate of the camera and from that they're supposed to be able to deduce things like its velocity. It should be a pretty simple lab but I think it's going to be a long one which is going to be fun so normally I have lab from 10.30 until 1 and I expect it to take every minute of it today. Yes, so this is the lab and what they're doing today is they're taking these little tripod things with cameras and they're taking pictures of events going on at a high exposure and just calculating things like velocities. So this is where I spend every Friday, I guess, morning. And then while they do their lab, I'm normally sitting here just grading papers until it's over, until someone asks me a question. But lab starts in like 10 minutes, so I'm gonna start setting up and I will let you know how it went. All done with lab now. Now I get to go home and finally get started on grading these papers. Sherrod has to TA lab in like 20 minutes. I feel bad. That's how he gets to spend his Friday. I'll see you guys see next you week. Guys. See you. I love you. Sorry if it's a little windy right now and it might be messing up the mic. I don't know, but I just walked out to the desert that's like 15 minutes from my apartment, 15 minute walk to just record some time lapses. I might put a couple in this video. That's gonna do it for this vlog though. I'm having fun with this so far. It's gonna take some practice and some time to get everything ironed out, you know, smoother transitions and make everyone super comfortable with the camera in the first place. First off, thank you to all the grad students who just made this so easy and, and interesting to record this week. So that, it, I love incorporating everybody into it. I'm excited to do more of it in the future. Let me know in the comment section if you like the video and I'll see you guys there.